Viewers at home. We are hopping into a set between TKO Sage and No Smo. Mo is up game one. So, um, we don't know what happened, what transpired. We just know that TKO No Smo, who is, his name is wrong, sorry. And they sat at the wrong seats for their players. So, Mo is rocking the Corrin. I mean, Mo, no, 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 no. Mo is rocking the Cloud. Sage, Corrin. Um, I I'm, I'm that interested Sage, to see what happened in game one to cause this. I think Daisy, maybe, or I lost. Or who else was Sage saying he's playing? I don't know. I know he plays. Or He started with Krom, right? Yeah, but he, he told me he does not play Krom. Yeah, Krom gets kind of boring after a while. Yeah, and it's so fucking boring getting gimped over and over again. God. Yeah, that's the thing. So annoying. Uh, that's my biggest Ouch. qualm with Roy, even though I have a uh, pretty good Roy. You just, you do so much work, and then you can, your stock is always in danger, no matter what. Yeah, you're definitely right on that. It's just really, really stressful. As Marth, I can really just play at my own pace. But... Anyway, uh... Mo actually taking that first stock, despite being down for most of the first stock. Yeah. Ow! Ooh. He... Did he almost flip it? Uh, it like it, I don't think so. There was like a half second before he like actually died after it. Yeah. Um, oh, the mix-up. The delay. Usually when you wait half a second, they're like, he's not going to finish it. And then they do. So sometimes you just have to commit to holding shield. That's the Mo classic. That is the Mo classic. Mo loves side B. He does. He really does, though. Um, yeah, he'll side B till he dies. Ride or die. Live and die by the side B. Wow. Speaking of, he's got limit. Oh, oh my, you are so He fished nuts. a little too hard. And now he's got no limit to recover if he needs to. Yeah, he's back on the stage, so yeah, he should you're, be you're, fine. Yeah, he's back on it. But he, it was scary for a second. Dude, All right. look at, listen to this target music. I love this song, dude. It's so fun. It's so fun. All right. Uh, Sage was trying to play patiently and feel out Mo, but uh, I don't feel like that was the correct option. Mo got back down and he started putting on the hurt as soon as he did. Ooh. Yeah, Mo a, a, a like, I don't know. I, I like rushing down Mo. Yeah. When I play. Sage is trying to feel out options, but uh, Mo is pushing his advantage way harder than Sage is, and you can see it in the damage. But but hey, it's even. It right is now. even. I would say until somebody takes a stock, it's even. Oh! oh. Ah, there was a better. That was, right? Yeah, that was it. A not even get hit by the up smash. Could you just side beat there out of shield? Side beat? Yeah, parry side beat. Or he just doesn't get hit by the up smash and F smash there instead of running in. Oh, well, he found the stocks. Okay, so. that was interesting. I like it. He's trying to make him a little more tricky to follow off the stage so Mo can't just run so off there. So many pummels. Dude, Ouch. I'm not going to lie. I kind of I kind of scumbagged Eddie. When I grabbed him, I started watching if he was mashing or not. So I just pummel. Yeah. That's hilarious. Hey, that's a, if you're sitting next to your opponent, that's a strategy. You can just listen for the mash. I always mash. Gotta get a, a soundproof controller so you can quietly mash. Yeah, or just make it to tournaments that have stages so you don't yeah. sit right next to your opponent. That's another strategy. Um, yo, shout out to Frotendo64. Coming in clutch for just, the assist. Did you see Stage look up at it? Yeah, I'm being yeah, serious. It's a meta thing. Like when j -Bot got on when we were playing, all I could think about was how cool j -Bot was. Dude, By the way, if j -Bot, I completely if blocked that out of my mind. Yeah, I was just like, damn, was that guy's so fucking cool. I gave him 10 bucks Ooh. on his stream one time. Did they nerf Shout out down smash power? I feel like that Maybe. wouldn't have killed in smash forward, but like that was definitely, he should have been further off stage, right? I don't know, but he was Mo basically was in just a, sent to the other side of the stage. In a good spot right oh, now. Oh, he went for the hard he went for the hard wait. Nice spot dodge. But Sage had good patience there. He knew that Mo would try to wait for him to drop shield. So he just kept holding. Indeed he right. did. Dio. Cloud, no kill throws, so Sage's best bet here is to hold, play safe and shield. Hold the R button. Or L. Whatever, man. This is where this is really important. Whoever takes Whoever can find the kill first is going to have a lot of momentum going into the next game. I would have F-tilted there or fair. Or just something to get him off stage. Yeah, that's all Cloud can do, man, is just throw him off stage once he gets a grab. Neutral. Oh, uh, he's going to look for it. I oh, told gonna... you. I went through the uncharged. The reads. Yeah, that was so obvious. You, it, you never see Mo back up like that when he has yeah, limit, unless when, he's going to go for neutral. Beam. When a Cloud has limit and they start dashing away from you, they're trying to trick you with the uh, B-reverse neutral. Beam. Mm -hmm. 
And he got it. He did. He did. Do you hear that? That chord ring through our ears every it, time uh, that a match ends. Boom! Oh, you lost. Get over it. So right. epic. Epic. Speaking of epic, uh, hey, well, that's whoa, 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 whoa! I've only used it once today, and you used it twice. So, so your counter is a little bit higher than mine. I used epic in the proper. Oh, manner, that's though. no, that's three. That is, you're out of you're out of them for today. First, you don't get to dictate how many times I say that. Alrighty, and everybody, we've got a loser's top eight game three situation here. Yeah, this stage could just is be truly epicness. Now, <laughs> and if you know my man no Sage, cloud. you know how much he doesn't oh, like cloud. No. Oh no! That drop down there. Oh, that works too. And. Uh, a truly epic play there by TKO No Snow. And um, you know, honestly, Sage coming out with the classic, the classic head shake. What can I do? And, and he just jabs and holds that. Sage doesn't want to play. He doesn't want to play. Okay, I can tell. So, he oh my God, he's just gonna take it. He's just, oh no, you shouldn't know. Oh wait, he's be back. Hey, wait, Sage is back. You shouldn't known there wouldn't be enough hits him. Yeah. You're not Crom. Sage knows it's Sage. Sage, that was weird. Did you see how he wasn't like moving? He was like yeah. purposely, purposely standing still. It's so weird. It's my game. It is, and it worked. It got Mo kill himself. Oh, this Ooh! is bad. This is bad. That was an epic nair to seal that stock, Theo. And that's Sage how you gotta really making an epic comeback there, to say the least. <laughs> uh, all right. But yeah, that's how you have game. to play one this game. One game of saying epic. I'll stop after this game. Ness, Ness really oh. has to work hard against Cloud. So anytime he can find those free low percent stocks, uh, that's where Ness wants to be. Indeed. And if Sage takes this game, it's uh, honestly uh, very it's still lucky. an uphill battle after that because he has to play on yeah. two counterpick stages. For and him. he's playing no. Ness against Cloud. Uh, just gonna catch that lining with the dash attack. So, that is still a good option. Okay, let, let's talk meta here. Let's say Sage loses this set. In the future, this is an interesting player matchup to look out for because. Oh my god, so much damage. Oh, so much damage! That's it. Wow. Good stuff that to was, no smoke. Did he get touched after he respawned? Was that a dare to death? I don't think so. I think he just died. Damn. Epic stuff from this one. Epic.